What's up guys, this is Charge, and today I'm gonna show yeah. you a little tutorial on how I made this border and um, this little chroma key for my Call of Duty video, my edit I did, the Charge OC Episode 7. I will show you it right here. If you haven't seen it, go to my channel. Check it out, it is uploaded on my channel, Connor's Charge, and as you can see this border right here, it covers the dark spots of the video and it looks pretty cool it's a nice little effect and uh, you can see it all around here and then it fades into the image I use which is the little um this little robot guy uh, I'll show you right here this is what I use so basically all you see is the Call of Duty uh, gameplay over this and like you can see the outsides of this in the dark marks um, like right here you can see the little like purple um, around on the outside yep on all the the darkest spots of the video and I'm gonna show you how to do that because I think it looks pretty cool it's original I don't think too many other people have ever done this if anyone has so this is how you do it first thing you gotta do is get out of iTunes and go into your Sony Vegas Pro or Vegas Movie Studio HD Platinum 11 which is what I have because I decided to buy it and it's awesome so first thing you're gonna do obviously is open up your video uh, I'm gonna go to videos uh, 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 to edit clip hive I'm gonna bring in a clip hive video do, do, do. High rise USP 5 man. I drag that right in there. And the first thing I'm going to do to my video is right click properties, uncheck maintain aspect ratio, and check disable resample. And I'm going to add my color corrections to this. I'm actually going to add color curves to this. My cool CCs. Uh, I have a tutorial on how to do these color curves to make it look like this. Just go ahead to my channel, check that video out. It is called Color Curve Tutorial Sony Vegas, something like that. Check that off. And as you can see, uh, if I bring this up right here, this is the original clip right here, and this is it with a color correction, and it's pretty nice. The next thing we're going to do is go down here to Light Rays. And this basically is going to add a darker border so that we can see the video, um, the background video through it. So we're going to go to Cyan Spotlight and drag it right on top. And we are going to change this radius sensitivity and all that stuff. I already have a preset, so you guys can just set yours to exactly this. The sensitivity and strength is going to be at zero. Um, you can do a bound radius at 1 and 1, the feather is at 750 or around there, and the color, the tint color is like a little white cyan, so like yours is going to be down here at cyan, just drag it so it's like a little bit white, a little bit cyan, like that, and you can see the difference, this is the clip and this is it with this preset added, it just makes it darker so there are actually spots to see the video through, go ahead and X out of that. Once you have those down, you can pause it at the spot where you can see what the presets are. And then we are going to go to the chroma keyer right here. And I already have mine, but you want to drag in any of these really. I'm just going to drag in the green screen. And then I'm going to go to my preset right here, 4 cod. And this is what you're going to do. You're going to make the color black, completely black, all these to the left. And then the, the low threshold, high threshold, and the blur amount is going to be based on your clip. So what you're going to want to do is sh do show mask only. And then this is the spot where you're going to see the video in the background through your Call of Duty gameplay. And you only want a little bit of it like I have here. So like I'm going to drag this to where I want it to be able to see be seen through, which is right there for me. And I just want a little bit of the video to be seen. You can change it to have more or less depending on what you want. The blur, you just want a little bit of blur so it's not like real rugged edges around here. You want a little bit of blurred edges. And you can animate it if you want to, if you're into that kind of stuff. But I'm just going to leave it like this. 
Uh, play around with it guys, that's the only way for you to get it the best way you want it. Make sure to uncheck show mask only so you get the clip back. And now we need the um, video to go behind this. So let's go to videos, actually let's go to music, and this right here is the picture I want behind it, this robot guy. Uh, as you can see, this is at the beginning of my video, so I'm just going to split this, drag it to where it stops, um, right there. Well, you could do that, or you can go like this, go to best, full, and then go right here to save snapshot to file, then uh, image one, or you can do robot. Uh, save that and it will come up right here and you can just drag this in there instead of having a video so I can just delete that video now and you have this image in the background and you can see right here that that looks very nice you can see the image overlay through here you can see the nice purples getting through this is what it looks like and this is the Call of Duty game over it and I think that looks awesome. I think that's really cool. All the dark spots of the video, it shows through very nicely. And if you want more of that or less of that to show through, you can go to the light rays and you can change like the the um, the radius here. You can turn down or I guess you could turn down the feather, turn down the radius, stuff like this. Uh, just to get like a darker border that will show through here. Obviously you don't want it like that. Um, but you know what I'm saying, you can just play around with it uh, as you would like. I like my sick little border presets here, I think that looks very nice. I want to know what you guys think though, so make sure to comment, like, subscribe to my channel for more of these. I think this is a very nice and original tutorial. I want to know what you guys think, like I said, this has been Charge, peace out my nuggets.